Hey guys, happy February. I can't believe it's February already, but I wanted to give you a sneak peek at what we do for Valentine's Day. Um, what I get my kids, what I get my husband, and also what we get the teachers and the students at the kid, in the kids class. Um, first, we do not go out to dinner for Valentine's Day because it's very busy and it's for couples and they don't want to hear kids in the background. So we decided when we had children that we were just going to do a Valentine's at home. We'll probably buy some steak, lobster, whatever we buy. Um, and we decorate. I decorate. Um, so I got a tablecloth for that. Um, I'm going to be decorating a lot. So I also got napkins. These are from last year. So I just decided to keep those. And I also got some plates to match um, from last year. So that is what we will have on our table. Now for the students, Allison and Sophia decided they did not want to make their own. They wanted to buy them from the store. So we did. This is for Allison's teacher, Miss B. Um, we bought this for her because she loves Reese's apparently. And we also got her a to-do list. This is from Target. It just says to-do and it has a pencil and a check mark so they can write down exactly what they need to get done. I thought that was really cute. So we're going to stick that together and give them, um, give her that. And then Allison's other teacher, um, we got her a little box and a notepad as well. And then for Sophia's teacher, she got her a little chocolate and a notepad as well. And then for, I believe this is for Sophia's class, she wanted the fruit roll-ups, so they're very small baby fruit roll-ups. And we're going to put everybody's name on there from Sophia. And then Allison wanted blow pops. And I just went today and bought a 100 pack of blow pops at BJ's for $8.99. This was $5, $4. I should have just went and bought the 100 pack. But anyways, um, so this is for Sophia's class. I'm sorry, Allison's class. <laughs> okay, now... On to Jason's gifts. Um, Sophia wanted to buy him something special. So she got him a Reese's, um, I don't know, little heart and Reese's pieces. And then um, Allison got him a rock candy, pink rock candy. And I bought him razors. I heard these are very good razors. They're Harry's razors. This comes with a razor. And I had to match his car, of course. And it comes with two extra blades, which he will go through those. So I bought him eight extra blades as well. And this really was not a bad price. This was $9.99. And this was $15.99 for eight extra blades. And normally, like, I think Gillette is, I don't know, I want to say $20 for eight. So that's a pretty good price. And then I also got him this post shave balm, hopefully, you know, just for something a little extra. And then he loves Reese's peanut butter cups too, but he likes the smaller ones with hearts. So we picked a pack up of those for him. And then of course I got cards from the dollar store for Jason, for the kids. Um, they wanted to get us cards, so that's what they got us. Now for the girls, um, I did pick up these bags from the dollar store. Aren't they cute? Look how glittery they are. I believe this one is Jason's. This one is Sophia's. Isn't that cute? And this one is Allison's. Be mine. So that the gifts will all go in there. They do not know about this. So if you're watching, turn it off. <laughs> um, last year or the year before last, I started writing notes to them. Starting February 1st, I started doing little notes on their door. And last year, I think we did the same thing that I'm doing this year. I bought them each a mailbox. And when um, they wake up in the morning, they check their mailbox. As long as the flag is up, there is something in there. So every day they will open their mailbox and there will be something special in there, either a piece of candy or a little note or um, just something fun for them just to tell them I love them. So I picked up this one for Sophia and I think 
Allison picked the same one. Yes. So there's those. And I got these at the dollar store for $1. And speaking of notes, I found this at Walmart. Oh my gosh, you guys, how cute is this? And this is perfect for the Valentine Day cards. What this is, it's a little post-it note, but it looks like a letter. You write your note on there and then you fold it into threes and they open it like a letter. How cute is that, right? So I thought that was very adorable. It was $1.67 at Walmart and you get 50. So that's more than enough. So that is what we will be doing every morning. I'll video it, don't worry. Okay, now for Allison, um, the gifts I got her was a rock candy, piece of rock candy. She loves rock candy, so I picked that up for her. Also at the dollar store, they have these rose petals. Actually, they're roses. Um, let me see. They're soap petals. So what you do is you take one of these and you put it in the bathtub and then it dissolves and it's soap. So I thought that would be cute for their bath time. They don't really take baths, but they will now. <laughs> I also picked up a pair of socks for her from the dollar store. I thought those were re really cute. And then I got her a little tank for her outfit. I picked up, this is so cute. I think this was eight or $9 at Walmart. Let me see. It was $9.88 at Walmart. It says love, it has a heart on it and it's long sleeve. Very cute, right guys? I picked it up in the juniors department. She's growing up so fast. <laughs> and then I bought her a pair of black, just regular legging pants. So nothing big on the leggings. She just likes the leggings. And then, so that will be her outfit. Um, we're gonna get give them their gifts probably three or four days early because Valentine's Day is on, I think, a Wednesday this year. And I think we're gonna do our Valentine's the weekend before, so that way, you know, they have their outfits and everything. And then I picked up this. I don't know if this is babyish for her or not, but I thought, you know, why not? Let's just get it. It gives her something to do. She's 10 years old. Um, she does like stickers, but I, I don't know. I was iffy about this one, but I thought, you know what? Let's just do it. This is a Silly Pet sticker face. So basically what you do, is you have all these stickers for faces, tails, I believe, bandanas, noses, eyes, all of that. How cute, and a little mouth and everything. And then what you do is on the next page, you make a face. So you have a duck and you decide what faces you want. You pick and choose what faces you want. And they have horses and pigs and fish and all kinds of stuff. So I thought, you know, that'd be cute. So this is what it looks like. This was, I wanna say $3.95 at Walmart, I believe. And then there's the, the horse on the back. So that is what I got, Allison. Now, Sophia, I did get her a few extra things because her outfit was not as much as Allison's outfit was. Um, hers is a little bit cheaper because she's a little bit younger. But she loves band-aids and she goes through band-aids like crazy so i bought her some band-aids they have hearts birds and more hearts and then i also bought her the rose petals or the roses with the petals um and they're soap and she goes to school and she likes she still likes kitty things um because she's only five or six and so i bought her from the dollar spot at target um, a fork and a spoon set. They're both very cute and Valentine's-ish. And that will be for her lunches. She still takes that kind of stuff. I also got her rock candy as well. And she got little baby, uh, little socks with hearts all over them. And this shirt, I'm telling you guys, so cute. I love this shirt. This was like the best design that I've seen for Valentine's Day. It's adorable. If they had one for me, I would totally get it. Look how adorable that is. Is that not the prettiest shirt you've ever seen? <laughs> Sorry, it is. It's just, I love that. And then, of course, I bought her shorts to go with it. Aren't these cute? Little pink shorts. So she will have that to wear on Valentine's Day with her cute little socks. 
And you know I bought the socks separate from the outfit. I didn't even realize they matched so perfectly. And then I also got her the same thing. It looks like it's a little bit different. Um, I bought her the silly pet sticker face book. Um, if they want to trade, they can, however they want to do it. But this is more like dogs. So maybe I'll give this one to Allison. I don't know. But it looks like it has pretty much the same. It for me, I am going to be posting a video about different Valentine treats that I am going to be making. So watch out for that. Um, and I hope you guys have a great Valentine's Day. Thanks, guys. Bye. Okay, so for the lunch valentine stuff this is what i have gotten so far i'm going to make sandwiches out of the cookie cutters i also got napkins of course and stickers because my girls love stickers somebody made a rude very rude comment the other day why do you give your kids stickers on their stuff because my kids like it so that's why i give it to them i don't find there's anything wrong with that um <clears throat> Tiny hearts, I probably won't give them a whole pack, but I'll give them a little bit um, each time they have like a yogurt or something like that. And then of course, the Valentine cakes, they're not getting both, don't worry, they'll probably get one and that's it. And then I have these little baby fruit roll-ups and also I picked up some pink goldfish, I thought that would be fun. And I got some sprinkles, they're hearts and arrows and I also have other sprinkles I believe and then this my friend had given me it's really cute you just do the month and the date and I figured for a countdown we could do that and also I do have jokes of the day as well for Valentine. In an upcoming video I'm going to be making different colored jello and some pudding so you will see that soon. I am also going to make something with these strawberry wafers more confectionery um, hearts and M&Ms, but you will see all of that coming up.